the breakfast club, bitches. You can call me the donkey of the day, but like, I mean no harm. Hey, donkey of the day for Friday, June 9th is really confusing me because I don't know who should get the biggest heat hard this morning. It's either going to a man named Xavier Pope or an Uber driver named Nicholas who drives a Toyota Tacoma. Drop one of the clues bombs for everybody listening to The Breakfast Club live from a Toyota Tacoma this morning. We appreciate you. Uh, I don't know whether Xavier or Nicholas should get the donkey, but I came across a New York Post article and I saw a headline, and I'm not going to lie, Nav Green. I thought about you immediately. For those of you just joining us, we have Carlos Miller and Nav Green from the 85 South Show in here. If you know anything about the 85 South Show, then you know Nav Green is a food connoisseur. Okay, best vegan recommendations I've ever heard came from Nav Green, and I know Nav really loves his food. So when I saw this headline, I thought about you, Nav, and I want you and Carlos to help me decide who should get donkey, because when I read the New York Post story, the headline says, my Uber Eats driver asked me for gas money to deliver my food. Do y'all want to hear more of the story, does that, or does that headline already make you feel something? A little bit more. Okay, a little bit more. Now, Xavier Pope, who's a Chicago resident, uh, by the way, he tweeted, this Uber Eats driver just asked me to cash app him gas money to bring my food to me. Pope said the driver was harassing him and wouldn't stop calling. Xavier tweeted, he has now called me five times. This is harassment. I am about to call the police on this dude. Now, let me read you the exchange. Okay, the Uber driver... Nicholas, all right? Nicholas and Xavier. The Uber driver said, yo, it's your Uber driver. I can't make it to you unless I can somehow get gas money. Hello? Xavier replied back, this is unprofessional. The Uber driver said, I understand. I'm very sorry, but let me know what you want me to do. I can't be stuck on the highway. It's the same thing as leaving a tip. Xavier replied, give me my food first. The guy Uber driver said, that's the problem. I don't have the gas to get to you. Uh, your food or else I wouldn't ask. I just need enough gas to make it to you, sir. That man said, sir, he means well. The driver was about to run out of gas, and he didn't realize the order was so far away. Now, Xavier called those people on Nicholas, and by those people, I mean Uber support, and Uber support said behavior like this is definitely not okay. Xavier said it's something I do not want to experience again. A person coming to my home pressuring me for money. Now, I'm confused who should get the biggest he hauled because I think Xavier overreacted. Xavier threatened to call the police because Nicholas said he needed some gas money to keep the Toyota the coma on the road. Nicholas said it's just like giving a tip. I hate to be the one to tell you, but that's the climate of the society we in. When we have public servants like Nicholas that make our lives easier, we got to take care of them. But then again, Nicholas, if you can't afford gas, then maybe you probably shouldn't have a job that requires a car. I told y'all nah, earlier. That's, 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 that's too much. That's too much, I Lose. think you should give them both donkey the other day because first of mm, all, talk to me, everybody who's an adult knows mm -hmm. when you asking somebody to do something that involves their vehicle, mm. gas money may come up mm. even if it's through an app even if what it's a i would have did mm. i would have sent i would have i would have sent him a look a look uh 10 or something right okay. but, but you did wait for. wait wait but then, you got it once i got my order i would have said i ain't get my order <laughs> I was going to recoup okay. mine on the back okay. end. He was getting okay. it regardless. Okay. I would have looked out for okay. the young brother. Because, okay. look, man, you know, I've been a delivery driver. Sometimes it do happen. Okay. But I'm saying you might have to take some of the some of your money, you know, your bank money. But he would have still been fired, though. Because he would have still been fired because he never delivering? got his food. I, was a, I used to deliver pizza oh. for Domino's. Shout out, out to Domino's. Best gas. job I ever had. <laughs> okay. I thought you were that. But he's still sad. That was for my own business. LLC. He still would have got fired, though, because you said the food never came. Now, you got a few times to not deliver the food. You don't get fired on the Okay, Who's gonna fire you? It's Uber Eats. You literally can you apply operator. it on the app. Yeah. There is no boss. Mm. Now, now, can we go to one of the world's foremost experts on food, Dav Green, here? So, look, <laughs> what I, I think first off and foremost, like if you're working for Uber or something like that, you when you see the money flash up, you're gonna press submit. Because mm -hmm. you see the money. Mm -hmm. But then you see the distance. He look at his gas tank. I can't make I can't it that make way. It. Now, as a food person, <clears throat> and I want my food. I'm going to help you help me. Mm -hmm. Right. So if you can't get to me, I'm canceling that order. Now I'm right. getting something. I'm going to at least get you yeah, to me, yeah. but I don't know how you're getting back. I don't yeah. know how you're getting back. So who should get donkey? Both of them. I told you both, both of them. Both of them. You think so too? Yes. I, I think the the person who didn't get his food, he didn't get his food. He 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 he, he, he had loses. options. He loses. He he had options. He mm. could have he could have got. He loses the most career. though, Charlemagne. Okay, I think y'all bugging. I want to ask you, Envy, but you don't like people that drive Toyota, so I don't even want your bougie ass. Nah, to say that. I don't, don't ask me. out the loop. But Toyota yeah, out the loop. Bro. Toyota Tacoma is is against twenty three miles per gallon. Uh, gas miles or highway miles, but I would say this: when you order something from Uber Eats, they charge you all those goddamn fees. It's not like they just say, "Okay, the yeah. meal's five dollars." They yeah. charge you five dollars. That money's not going to plus the a delivery, though. plus a delivery fee, 
Plus, they charge you another fee, then the taxes, and then they ask you if but you want to get a tip still or a gotta get there, though. Envy, have you ever been hungry and mad? No. See? Exactly. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> you got a day right now. <laughs> you, don't, you don't struggle enough. Yeah, I don't struggle you don't struggle way. enough. That's why you're not able yeah, to connect with these regular issues. You have too much going. You, bro, you live a great life, and we support that. I work you hard. Are, you're like I you're work a role hard. model to the black community. Nah, I work but you hard. jumping in and out of Ferraris and, yeah, and all this. You probably never he was even in a had I, Uber Eats. I work no, hard. I, I do have Uber Eats every day, but I, I, I work pretty hard. But I will say this. Oh, I agree with Lowe's. Let's give the double donkey to uh, the Nicholas. And um, exactly. Xavier. Yeah, they just arguing y'all. back and forth. That's sad. That's that's true. True. Yeah, that y'all sad. can't make that Hold man on. give a tip. Now close BT up. All right, BT, we see y'all later. Everybody else, we see y'all Monday, BT. All right. Now get back on NBA. Now, see, this, this, that's this, exactly this, what I'm saying, though. He the type of person like, well, the service wasn't that good. Mm-hmm. I ain't going to tip. No, Envy, you have to tip. No, I don't. Those people you who are in the tip, service man. industry, they depend on if, rich if, people like you to come through and leave good I'm, tips, I'm, whether the I'm service is good or see, not. See, that's the problem. You can't You're leave a tip if the service is not good. I'm going to leave a tip depending on if the service is good or not. Then they that. have to make don't good service. Don't hold the staff accountable for the restaurant. You ever been to a restaurant and they treat you like ish? They don't come back and refill your water. They don't do anything. And That's you why you need tip? to tip. No. I'm not tipping for bad you, you service. You tip now, for though. good service, not for bad service. service. Yeah, 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 you not, can't tip for you bad service. You can't tip for Y'all bad tripping. service. You can't do Y'all what you want to do and still expect to That's get right. tipped. That's exactly. Right. That's right. I'm not saying tip people with bad service. That's what you just but said. what I'm saying is this is how these people make their money. Correct. So you probably getting bad service because they don't have gas in the Tacoma. Because they're not making money at yeah, work. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. everybody who come in there say, hey, we getting bad service. What if it's a bad but restaurant? I would have gave the man gas money. I would have gave him gas money. I would have gave, gave, gave him gas money, too. But you're not going to pressure me into giving you gas money. Yeah, that trust was, that's that not was, pressure. That's trust me, asking. But you but that's me you. But that's his you mistake. You on the radio every morning. Wherever that's his you mistake. go, you getting pressed for a tip, whether it's good or not. I don't know how you feel about that, but that's just the facts what, of life. Right, that's how you press for a tip, Envy. I don't know. Mm. When, I, when I go out, I, I tip. I, I, I tip well. No, I tip. I tip. I tip well. I tip. I damn near tip well. Twenty twenty five percent when I tip. But when the service is good, if the service is bad, what you do? I ain't gonna tip you nothing. I agree. I can't. I can't tip you for bad. Service. I, I'll give you a little something bad. I give you the service. basics yeah. for bad yeah, service. Yeah, basics. I'll give you, you five dollars. I'm, 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 I'm not. I'm not gonna tip you well for, for just because I have I to. I think that's no. what Lowe's is saying. Even if they're giving bad service, you should just give them a basic tip. But if, you do, if you're doing yes. a great job, yes. you get a big tip. Should you pull them to the side and tell them why you didn't tip them as good as you would after you eat? Yeah, after so you they eat. don't spit in your food. After you, well, let, that, this is a good topic. Let's yes, talk sir. about this. 800-585-1051. Charlemagne gave Donkey a day to two men. Yeah, Xavier and uh, Nicholas. All right, and the reason you gave him Donkey today was because of because what? Because Nicholas uh, is an Uber driver, and he straight up asked for gas money because he couldn't get to Xavier. I don't see a problem with that personally. You know what I'm saying? Xavier threatened to call the police on him and report him to Uber. But this is the thing. We don't even know if Xavier had the money. Like Uber Eats is expensive as hell. Too. We That's don't know true. if he had the money. Then, then you got to yeah. factor in the location. But that might have been his last money. That might have been his last dollar to get that food. And now you want me to give you extra and I don't have it. And you're saying I'm not going to bring your true. food unless I true. give you a tip. And this is all I got. All this is he true. He could be a college student. He could be like, but you can't make somebody give you a tip to bring my food that I paid he for already. He didn't try to make him. He did ask. But Charlamagne, he, he, he humbly actually asked. dropped the food off. He did drop it. He got it there. And the guy said, mmm, tasty. Yeah, he should get dunk the day. Because you being sarcastic. I, I gave it both to him. Yeah. All right, well, let's open, open up the phone, phone lines. 800-585-1051. What are your thoughts? Let's talk about it. It's the Breakfast Free the Club. Free Uber Good driver. Morning. Donkey today is brought to you by the law office of Michael S. Lamisoff. Don't be a donkey. Dial pound 250 on your cell and say the bull if you've been hurt in a construction accident. That's pound 250 from your cell and say the bull. Wake that ass up. Early in the morning. The Breakfast Club.